I went to the doctor to do my physical exam and I got the result two weeks ago. Unfortunately, I do have some minor issues with some of the blood test results and that's why for the past few weeks we have been changing and tweaking our lifestyle and diet and I do have three things to watch out for. One is creatinine level and this one, I must say I'm not so shocked because for the past few months I've been taking creatine as a supplement because I do feel stronger and I feel that I can lift heavier weights when I take them. The normal range, at least in China, because I found out that the range, the normal range in other countries can be a bit different. So in China, the normal range is 57 to 97 and for me, I got 112.5. However, when I went to Mayo Clinic, the normal range is 65.4 to 119.3. And I went to another website and the website is called Mount Sinai, I think. And the range is 61.9 to 114.9. And again, I'm 112.5. So in both websites, I'm still within the range, but just to be on the safe side, I decided to stop taking creatine. Second one is uric acid and this one I'm not so surprised either because uric acid tends to be higher for some Asians and I always had this when I was younger, even on my 20s and I always am able to manage it and that's the reason also why I don't drink a lot of beer. Unfortunately, this year I started to re introduce beer into my lifestyle and so that's why it has stopped and I think that's the main reason why I have a high uric acid. The third one is going to be interesting and very shocking so I do have a high level of cholesterol. The normal level should be 5.2 and I'm 5.71. That is why for the past few weeks we have been eating overnight oats in the morning and we also eat and then put in our diet flax seeds, walnut, mixed nuts, beans, salmon and also we take supplements like uh, for omega-3 so that's really healthy to control the level of cholesterol and I also incorporated more cardio to my workout routine because I do work out, I do lift weights but actually I don't do a lot of cardio so that's something that I've been doing for the past few weeks since knowing the result and lastly I think the most important thing that I've learned is that I must say the issue is not exactly my diet but more of the alcohol intake so I do socialize a lot and now it's definitely a wake-up call that I need to drink moderately more in control and that I'm not getting any younger so I'm on my early 40s so yeah I do need to make a change If you got the time, I'd like to stay a while. Do you remember what I said last time we met? Would you like to move a little closer now? I'd like to be as close to you as I can get. Stop the time, sure, but in this moment
If you'll notice, I'm sitting here because I'm going to have a video call and this is a better background and because I'm in front of a window so it's a better lighting as well. Otherwise, if I sit on the other side of the table, I will just look like a, a shadow because I'm going to be against the light and the background is just going to be a bit boring. So I prefer to sit here if it's going to be a video call. So anyway, today apart from my personal errands, um, it has been a productive day. I have been busy with sourcing candidates so in our industry i'm a headhunter so what it means that um if a client decides to use me i need to look for candidates so i've been sourcing a lot of candidates through different means through personal network or linkedin and etc it's a bit boring work stuff but anyway that's what i do and um yeah i think this year just to share to you as well that it has been super super tough because a lot of companies are not doing well and there's a lot of layoffs and also restructuring so it means that there's not a lot of recruitment needs and even if they are usually they don't have a lot of budget for headhunters which is what i do so i have a direct impact to what's happening to the job market but i must say this year has been tough i don't have a lot of clients that are using me but I am still very lucky that there are some few clients that are doing very well. Not a lot of them, but there are still very few and they are still using me and uh, no complaints. I must say I'm still very lucky and just trying to be optimistic and positive. And so yeah, so that's what I do. And uh, I'll just do a call right now, um, just a quick one. And then I'm going to go to the grocery.